dazzling and wondrous, brilliant and colorful. These are the words we use to describe Qinghuai Lantern Festival in Nanjing. The Qinghuai River at night is like the prosperous sight in a poem written by Chinese poet Liu Yazi. Fiery trees and silvery flowers shine on a bright night sky. In the festival, by enjoying the lanterns, people pray for health and love, expressing their joy and making good wishes. As the first batch of national intangible cultural heritage, the embryonic form of Qinghuai Lantern Festival appeared in the Three Kingdoms period. The earliest written records were in the Southern Dynasties. The history of Southern Dynasties recounts a grand event of Jian Kong's Lantern Festival. Tens of thousands of fire lanterns were gathered, like a river of stars in the sky. And crowds of people jostled one another with no gaps in the wide field. Later, in the Tang, Song, Yuan, and Ming dynasties, the Lantern Festival became more popular than ever. Paintings such as the bustling and hustling of Nanjing depicted the lively scenes of lanterns and the people watching the performance. Welcome to the 37th Qinghuai Lantern Festival! This year's Lantern Festival mainly consists of three touring lines, Confucius Temple, Lao Mendong, and Qinghuai River. In the Confucius Temple, the exquisitely designed lantern groups like Lotus Lanterns, Cup Lanterns, and Number One Scholar Lanterns present traditional Chinese culture's unique and profound charm. Both sides of the commercial street are dotted with colorful lanterns, illuminating the faces of hundreds of tourists. Their faces are different, but they share the same happiness. Next, in Lao Wendong, what appeal to tourists the most are various rabbit lanterns, which ideally suit the year of rabbit. Look, this is lucky rabbit up to 15 meters high. Spectacular, isn't it? If the lanterns on the ground can't satisfy you, there are also lanterns above the water. In Bai Lu Zhou Park, taking the boat in Qinghuai River and relishing the beauty of lights on water is indeed an excellent experience. The reflections from the light twinkled in the river, which offers you a new vision to appreciate Jingling. In recent years, the art of colored lantern making has rapidly developed. Combined with modern technology of electronics, machinery, and remote control, traditional lantern making applies new techniques in the production process. Modern lantern making upgrades the viewing experience comprehensively and creates an immersive experience sightseeing. It not only adopts the unique shapes of colored lanterns, but also introduces cultural creativity like night economy by combining catering, entertainment, sightseeing, and leisure in one place. Welcome to Qinghuai Lantern Festival in Nanjing and immerse yourself in the Spring Festival atmosphere. Come to Nanjing and join us!